factors they were present and the patient has come to you with the swelling and the redness of the eye right okay now see here if we were level of consciousness headache or you will see the these symptoms i cannot identify this is a case of preceptal orbital any case coming to me with a perspiratory should i think of this is perceptual or orbital no not at all i will just consider when patient is coming to me with the redness of the eye with redness that is present around the eye then i will think of this septal orbital cellulitis okay now see the difference very very important to look for preceptal or orbital just one or two points they will give you all these things yeah i have to read this one but if the patient cannot open the eye and if the patient can open the eye when the patient is having the redness of the eyelid but he can open the eye it means he this is a case of preceptal cellulitis okay when my patient has redness around the eyelids but he cannot open the eye okay i cannot assess the eye movements of the patient i will say him i want to look for the movements of your extraocular muscles but if i cannot then it means no this is not uh, this is a case of orbital cellulitis just these one two points they are enough to make your diagnosis of the orbital rp sector i will just read this one <clears throat> and like see here decreased gcs and headaches they are features of the orbital cellulitis systemic and wellness toxic that this is a feature of the orbital visual impairment red green color differentiation that is lost early okay this is a feature of the orbital cellulitis orbital pain tenderness that is present of thalmoplegia that is present okay now in the exam in the scenario they will give you basically this question to look for can you are you able to differentiate be between these two or not okay if uncertain so see here i dr sheen i am watching this patient i am looking at this patient but no i cannot assess this patient is having orbital or preceptal i am a bit confused so please do not get any uh, do not harm the patient immediately refer this patient to ophthalmological review okay okay if i am confused i should treat it orbital cellulitis till i am planning for the ct scan so patient safety that is the priority it's not my knowledge it's not my way of looking at the patient examining the patient patient safety is my priority so i will manage this case as a case of orbital cellulitis it means there is a difference between these two okay no investigation i will not go on the investigation at now why there are specific indications why these investigations they are important i will first first of all we will make some scenarios when i am going to look for 